In the last lesson, we created a file and then we deleted it. And let's say this was an accident. We didn't actually want to delete this. Now let's set ourselves up for failure because this is absolutely going to happen to you down the line. This happens to me quite often, not every day, but it happens to me quite often when I get a little bit sloppy. So when I do git add, and let's say I just wanted to add all my files to be committed, and I do git status. This file now says it's been deleted and that's going to go out on the next commit. Now, what if this was a really important file? What, what if this was a settings file or a configuration file for my entire project? And I'm like, oh no, I don't want to commit this. How, how do I get this to not be staged anymore? Now that's actually super, super easy. We can actually see it says in here, git reset head file. Now we can actually do this really easily. Honestly, we just have to follow the instructions that are in here. Git reset head in capital letters, and then the file name, firstpush.txt. Unstage changes after reset. Let's do git status again. This, this is where git status really comes in. It's super important. We can see that the file has now not been staged to commit. We unstaged it. Now, it hasn't been undeleted, but it has been unstaged. So now if we were to make another commit or add other files, we don't have to worry about having this accidentally pushed into our repository. Because again, what if this was a big mistake? What if this was a settings file? Or a project configuration file that was really important, we accidentally deleted it. Well, with Git, we could always go back in time and bring it back, but this is an easier way. We're preventing the problem from happening first. So let's go over this example just one more time. Let's do git add first push.txt. Let's do git status. And we can see that it's been deleted in there. Now to unstage this, all we have to do is git reset head and then the file name first push.txt. Get status again, it says unstaged changes after reset. And we have officially staged and unstaged a file. Now what happens if we accidentally deleted this from our computer? Because again, that happens from time to time. We accidentally run a program that deletes something or we accidentally delete the wrong file. How do we, how do we undo this? Well, with Git, because this is a versioning system, we can undo this delete entirely. I'll show you how to do that in the next lesson.